Hello, and it's a great privilege to be Auf Schalke, as the locals tend to say. We're here in Germany's industrial heartland in the great city of Gelsenkirchen. I'm Derek Ray, ready here on the commentary position, and alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfielder Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you live action from the Bundesliga in a matter of moments. It's Schalke facing Eintracht Frankfurt. Well, Derek, as is always the case, the team that dominates midfield will be the team that controls the flow of the game. And that, for me, is the area that's key today. And here's the starting 11 for Schalke. Well, they're starting with an attacking 4-5-1 formation with three players in advance of two holding midfielders. But it's important that the wide players come in field to join the centre forward at the right time. And the starting 11 for Eintracht Frankfurt. Well, as you can see, they're playing with a diamond in midfield, which allows them to dominate the central area, but does leave them exposed out wide. And the match is underway. Kenan Karaman. Here's Gutsu now. Can he finish? Now able to close down the short. Good, sir. That's all they can conjure for now. And the advantage accrues to the attacking side. Good, sir. Can he put them in front? Yes is the emphatic answer. And you have to say it was on the cards. Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. So underway again here. One nil the score. Loves to attack from the wide areas. And space available inside. Takes the shot. Terrific block. And the referee's verdict is penalty kick. Chance to even things up here. And a goal! He was composure personified, and he's done his job from the spot. Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. Back underway, level pegging. One goal apiece in this game. Mario Götze, Kamada, Lindström. And the danger clear. Well, doesn't have to do it on his own. Can they nudge in front? And a goal it is to put them in front again. No less than they deserve.
Well, as you can see, he makes it look easy in the end, but I think that's a good finish. He'll be pleased with that. Well, underway again, it's a narrow 2 1 lead as things stand. Well, they've given him too much space, and it might be. And a goal! The quick one, too, and they've turned this game on its head. Well, as you can see, he's just placed that beyond the keeper. That's a very good finish. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Bülter and winning it back well no surprise there Schalke have had more possession but their attacking play has been too slow mainly due to a lack of movement of the front players at some point they have to threaten the space in behind the defenders otherwise they're going to lose this oh it's developing nicely for them here and a goal they're running riot here almost out of sight Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Well, you've got to say, an incredible first-half performance. That scoreline tells you all you need to know. Kral. Well, nicely cut out. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Lovely work to get past his man. Takes it on! And that is going to be all for the first 45 here, Auf Schalke. And we're focusing on him for a reason, Stuart. He's asking plenty of questions of the defenders. Well, he's been brilliant today. His skill, his movement, his goals. What a good performance. And he's not finished just yet. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Well, the advantage didn't really accrue to them, and so it's going to be a free kick. Well, warned by the referee, but not cautioned. Well, he can't say he hasn't been warned now. That's good from the referee. Oh, dear. Well, that's not one that's going to linger long in the memory. Well, he had a go there. Nothing wrong with that, but he's got that all wrong. Well, I must say, he acquitted himself well under pressure. Able to skip past his man. Well, it really wasn't a great effort, was it? So. And he read it well, intercepting it. Terode. Now, potential danger. It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. And the quality of pass needs to be a bit better. And he has options available. 30 minutes to go then. Wasted possession again. Into the advanced position. And the pass could do damage. There it is! A fantastic goal and no wonder he's off celebrating. Well, let's look at this again. 
to pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, but I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it should go in at that near post. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Nice switch of play. Well, Frankfurt haven't had that much of the ball so far, but what they've done with it has been really good. And they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. They love to play on the counter-attack. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Now, let's see what they can do here. But nothing comes of it. Good defending it was. Good use of advantage by the referee. Plenty of support here. As eyes for goal. And able to close down the shots. Possession one. Now we're inside the final ten minutes in this one. And the cross goes in. On a time for composure on the ball. Terode racing forward, trying to catch them out. Well, not to be in terms of the counter attack. And what can they do to stop him running at them? It's there for him. And he read it well. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. And that is that. The referee blows his whistle for full time, and it's a victory for the visitors. Well, Derek, it was a comfortable win in the end. Fully deserved their victory because they dominated every aspect of the game. It was a really good result for them here today. No two ways about it. He really has brought his influence to bear on the proceedings. Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat. And he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was.